Good left by, good counter by Pagara. He's down, he's down, he's down. down. He hurt Isaac. Taong 2014, nang dumayo dito sa Pilipinas ang former WBO Asia Pacific Super Flyweight Champion at Indonesian Bantamweight Champion na si Isaac Jr. Upang sagupain ang ating kababayan na si Prince Albert Pagara para sa isang 10 round Super Bantamweight Contest. Bago ang laban kay Prince Albert Pagara ay may limang Pinoy na tinatalo na itong si Isaac Jr. Kaya naman mataas ang kumpiyansa nito na kaya niya ring talunin si Pagara. Ang laban ng dalawa ay ginanap sa Soler Resort Hotel and Casino sa Paranaque City. At bago ang kanilang bakbakan ay may baong kartada si Isaac Jr. na 24 wins, 4 losses, 2 draw at may 8 KO. Habang si Prince Albert Pagara naman ay may record noong 18 wins, 0 loss at may 12 KO. Halina mga boss at muli nating balikan ang kanilang naging bakbakan. Prince Albert Pagara was moved up uh, to the main supporting bout on this card. And let's see, this is a big opportunity for him. Malaking tulong niyang para yung career niya. At ito na, round number one po tayo. Ito ay 122 pounds, mga junior featherweights or super bantamweights. Prince Albert Pagara, the fire in the red Bronx. At ito naman si Isaac Jr. Talagang multi-stripes, ha? Yung kanyang trunks. Junior in the black, red, and brown trunks. Pagara. Just feeling more brown. Very unorthodox ang style nitong si Isaac Jr. He has his own version of the Floyd Mayweather shoulder roll, which you might end up seeing. Ang sabi niya, he has prepared well for this fight. Pero eto na, the heavy bombardment from Prince Albert Pagara. Pero Isaac Jr., matibay din eh, matibay din. By the way, walk in the corner is his trainer, who is a journalist, Jeffrey Pamuangas of Indonesia. Indonesia has had its share of world champions. Back in the 1980s, Elias Pical was also a uh, champion, Nico, super flyweight. Then Nico Thomas, right? Yes, although pinaka-recent, eh, medyo bad news kasi si Chris John ay na-dethrone na by Simpiwe Betieka of South Africa who will defend his title against Nonito Donaire this coming May 31 May 31 in Macau also on the card will be Brian Viloria so Kulibok Kulibok tayo and Pagara trying to come up with an explosive ending dito pala mo sa opening round almost went through the ropes you can see alam mo na, when you fight in a venue dito sa Like Sule, iba talaga eh. You want to put on a show. You want to put on an impressive performance. Kasi, hindi mo yung mga tao dito. Iba. What a great venue. Itong grand ballroom ng Sule Resort and Casino. Right hand from Prince Albert. Sabi niya, yan talaga ang malakas kong suntok. Yang right straight. Lalo na against eh, South Po. But, oh, good left by, good counter by Pagara. He's down, he's down, here he's down. He hurt Isaac Jr. Matapos tamaan ng body shot ni Prince Albert Pagara, ay bumagsak si Isaac Jr. sa round 1 at hindi na nga nito nagawang makatayo pa. Isaac Jr. And Isaac Jr. is down and out. Oh boy! Wow! He was bombarded to the hilt. Maganda yung performance ni Prince Albert Pagara. Yeah, I'm 
po natin ang kanyang, kanyang diskarte. Yung left. Big left. Right. At dito. Left hook. Sunod-sunod na. Isaac Jr. seeking refuge along shot. the ropes. Ganda. Good right to the body. Yun ang tumapos. Yun. Yung kanan sa bodega. Yeah. Just to the, actually, the ribs. Di ba? Right to the bread basket. Yun ang dumali sa may tadyang. Oh. And Isaac Jr. Drop like a sack of potatoes. Prince Albert showing no remorse. Grabe ang ginawa itong bata na ito. Hail Prince Albert the Blonde Bummer. Nine. The winner by knockout. And still undefeated from the Philippines, Prince Albert Pagara. Ngayon ngang nakabalik na si Prince Albert Pagara sa pagboboxing, sana ay mabigyan pa ito ng maraming laban at mapasabak na sana sa isang world title.